just had my food shop delivered um, by Iceland. I had the six to eight um, morning slot and it was um, delivered at 20 to seven. And they did um, beforehand um, text me um, the half an hour they will be delivering. So um, a lot of it, I'm afraid, is repeat buys. There's a couple of different items. So I try to incorporate something different um, each time. And I do um, obviously take note of the recommendations that I've had subscribers, um, you know, um, tell me about and offers. Um, for I think about the third week, we'll start over here. I've gone for their Sunday roast um, offer. Um, I believe it's £9.75. And you have, first of all, you have a choice of joints. And I went for the butter basted chicken breast joint. Um, Aunt Betsy's roast potatoes. There was about four different potato products you could choose. Um, Yorkshire puddings there, um, mixed veg and then, sorry, I'm sitting on my floor cushion and I come up, I've gone for the Million Airs cheesecake this time. Normally I go for the plain cheesecake but we thought we'd go for something different and I think I actually missed the picky blankets. Um, so for £9.75, I believe it is, that I think is a very good offer for three adults and the two guys obviously are quite um, big eaters, especially in the evenings. Um, they do have quite, um, you know, manual jobs. So that I feel is a really good offer. Um, I'll carry on with the freezer stuff um, to start with, I think, if I arch over on my cushion. Um, been going on, I normally have Iceland's um, just, you know, deep pan pizzas, but we've been going um, for these quite a bit. The guys are really enjoying this. Um, so I tend to have um, three pizzas. I only tend to have a little bit, then some salad stuff. Um, but as I said, um, these are all um, the stuffed cheese crust so we've got cheese filled crust there we've got the um barbecue chicken does say limited edition so i'm not sure um how long um some of these um products will be shown but we've had this quite some time i think they put limited edition to see how it um sells that's my i presume is what it is and then underneath, I've got the barbecued meat feast. That's got a tiny bit of kick to it, that one. And as you can see, that's a limited edition. They're all £2 each. For, so for £6, I don't think that's a bad um, meal for three adults. Although saying that I do usually have potato salad or cheesy coleslaw, which is actually there, and sometimes some salad stuff. But I need to go out um, with one of the guys to get my fresh stuff. Um, we haven't had fish for a while. I'm trying to think. It's either £6 or £6.50 for two boxes. So basically, that is for two weeks, um, for two meals. Um, for the three adults so as I said sometimes I do that and then repeat by all the time is the quarter pounders um, they like those in rolls with salad and cheese and sometimes bacon the works that is my take on instead of going to Burger King at the moment um, the guys don't like McDonald's we go occasionally if we're away and so we're on the road or something and that's the only thing that's available um we did have it once in cornwall and i'm sorry mcdonald's but it was absolutely disgusting we didn't like it whatsoever and it does run expensive the guys do prefer burger king um but since the lockdown we've only had a couple of um takeaways and they have actually been kfc um and our son's kindly bought those but back to the burgers 
so I think they are £2.25 a box and I have eight because very often Hobby will also have a quarter pound or a couple instead of chicken depending on what chicken we have I am a chicken lover and so is my son um, but I'm supposed to, I keep saying this, I'm supposed to eat more red meat. That's why I want to go out. We may be going to Lidl actually to get some fresh meat. Um, the minted quarter pounders, I love these, whether it's on the barbecue um, with fries and salad or um, I can do it as a roast dinner midweek. We've got um, ice creams. That is, again, this week has been very hard getting ice creams. Um, especially online, but I managed to get those. And Hubby's favourites is the six eclairs for a pound. Something I can't remember ever having before. I've gone for this blueberry tart that you cook in the oven, and that was two pounds. Up the back there, I've got two lots of Pringles. Now, Normally I don't pay more than £1.50, I think they were £1.75, that's still better than the £2.75, it's just that with my son having a couple of days off, I wanted to get him a couple of treats, and they can be quite expensive around the corner shop. Um, Flaming Hot um, Cheetos, that's eight packets for a pound, and I have purchased two lots of those. Um, the Pepsi Max... The offer came up as two for three pound fifty, um, but I did check because they are selling the three litre bottle now for one pound fifty. But I could only get five bottles because I like to get a little bit ahead for Christmas. Um, so when it gets into September, sort of get an extra bottle here and a can there and that sort of thing, um, so that when it comes to the more expensive items like um, Christmas pudding, the turkey and a thing because I normally allow £30 in money for a turkey. Um, so getting little bits like that in, yeah, but if it was Pringles or something like that, I have to hide them to make sure they're not eaten. And also I have to check the dates. I've also got the 24 Classic Meaty um, Crisps there. At the back there, I've got two lots of the wool buttons rolls. They're a pound each for eight rolls per pack. And then I've once again, second week, yay, I've got my two wool buttons um, loaves of bread, which I'm really happy about. I think I still was struggling to get the wool buttons bread because a few weeks I didn't have any bread or had one loaf. Coming down on some of the um, sort of fridge stuff, I've got my milk there. Um, I've got um, one um, of the strawberry milk. I will have to check because I thought I ordered two, um, but I'll check my list to see that it is one ordered or and um, one cent or whatever. Sometimes it comes up to ordered one cent, um, but you don't get charged. So I'll have to check that out. Um, two lots of the Cathedral Mature Cheddar Cheese. Those packs were two for five pounds. Um, we've got the cheese slices again because um, the guys like them on their burgers. As I said, it's burgers, cheese, salad, tomato, sometimes bacon. It works out cheaper and less hassle than having to have a takeaway. Um, that's just us. Even better if it's done on the barbecue and I don't have to cook it. Got utterly butterly there, that was a pound. And we haven't had pork pie for ages. And hubby asked for some pork pie. So um, that's the Vale of Mulberry. So um, I'm sure we've had that pork pie before. And then going on to cooked meats, I've got the um, cooked ham there. Um, I've got and the pork and apple roll both a pound each that's for my son's packing up got one lot of fries there and they are the barbecue chicken strips we've had those constantly that was one thing that was new um, quite some time ago and it's now a repeat buy um, I did mention to a subscriber we did have the um, cola um, 
sticky wings and nobody liked them. They didn't taste of cola and it had a weird taste and it's one thing, actually I don't even think the guys finished eating it, um, but when I am not sure that um, anyone's going to be liking the item, what I tend to do is um, say it's another chicken item, which I will be showing you in a minute, which is down here. I will do something else with it, um, if that makes sense. Maybe do a half a portion of each, just in case, because it's, it, I don't know about anybody else, but you know, you pair food, and if it's something, um, I can't always do it this way, but if it's something that um, is not to anybody's liking, and then you feel as though I've either got to cook something else, they have on one occasion, maybe two, have ended up having cereal for supper just for the fact that, um, you know, it was something that I was trying out and they didn't like. Um, that's enough waffling about that, but I'm sure you can understand what I'm saying. I've got the Smarty Buttons, um, that's a repeat buy um, a couple of times now. Bananas there. Um, I haven't managed to get my banana instant wet because normally for a quick, easy dessert, I do instant whip, banana instant whip, that is, with sliced banana in it. Um, scones or scones, yes, I always say both because it depends on what part of the country you come from. And cheesy coleslaw there. I have got my sack of potatoes. I normally have the really large sack, you know what I mean, um, from my stall. But again, the stall's not there. I'm not sure if it's coming back may have to check that out this coming week and this was a um a product that someone recommended so i thought we'd give this um a go i personally i may try one but i've got a sneaky feeling these are going to be too spicy and i'll probably do some of these some maybe that or some southern fried chicken with it and have a mixed chicken dish like kfc sort of thing um my son actually requested these and um i am not sure about this but then again i keep wanting to try different products and it does say caution hot warning fresh chili breadcrumbs coating very hot so i think this is going to be too spicy I do like the um, spicy chicken wings from KFC. That's about my limit, but I think this is going to be a no-no, especially for me. Probably hubby won't enjoy those either, um, but there you are. Maybe, you know, just a few and then mix it with something else. We shall see. Um, so that is my Iceland food shop. I've had a little bit of waffle this morning. I am a morning person. I know my last shop may seem to be, oh, this is this, this is my burgers, this is my unminted lamb burgers, you know, sort of attitude. But it was, it got quite late and I was tired. It was a day that I was doing a lot and I think I did it in about four minutes as this, I think it's coming up to 14 minutes because um, I just got evening just had a meal and everything and wanted to get cleared up and um, sit down for the evening but I did get my early morning slot I'm finding I have to book them for this area um earlier and earlier to get the slot I want and as I was up at half five it wasn't a problem so hopefully you've enjoyed this video thanks for watching goodbye